All right. Whoa. Mo, that's victories in GLS. Yeah, I know. Did you not? I guess. I guess it just wants to remind me because I hadn't tried it yet. I mean, I appreciate it. Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cowbling, Copy Kitty, and wow, do I need a good time today. So I'm going to grab them. The goal is to play until 21. Here is the Flood Cavern. There's only one difficulty. Let's have fun. Okay, yeah, huh? Alright, it's just alright. Uh, if you take too long, whether you use the verse or not. Uh huh. Mm, I, yeah, that would make sense, honestly. Look, making levels is hard. Uh, I, I hope it's not too long and strenuous. I, I hope I'm not in the part of the Packard's levels that were bad. I mean, I doubt that's going to be the case. Because, like, why would you keep those? And, like, that doesn't make any sense. Whoops, going around the lava. Uh, that's the kind of thing we're up to these days. You guys are just appearing. You're trying your best to swim. It is adorable. I appreciate it. Ah, flowers on fire. It is... Whoa, boy. All right, we're doing this again? Things have calmed down. The X story. Stop being a monster. All right, all right. Where were we? Right, yeah. So, yeah. Um... Copy Kitty is, you know, in my three-day re re recording cycle is the third one because I feel like, in general, I'm running out of air. Because in general, I feel like it's a safe bet that I'm gonna have a pretty good time. Except, man, uh, kind of cutting it close there. <laughs> man. All right, Glistening Cave. That's the name, at least I remember. All right, no intro to that one. It's just here, it's this. This is it. This is the cave that glistens. You go here and you expect flashy things. There's something really fun going on with a background. If I may opinionate about it, there's something really fun happening yet. Whoa, dude, I want that. I want bouncing lightning. Look at that thing. I don't want that though. Hell no. Alright, glad we had this conversation. I have a sword now. The drill can have a taste once it is midnight. Not until then though. I can soar through a wall, no problem. I can swoosh around at a drill. That guy died and I'm not sure why. Gonna reach through and get my kill. Yeah, yeah! Here we go. We hit upon a gold mine. Blow up this mine. Gold mine and a mole mine. And we're having this talk, I guess. Oh, you got tornado, which I guess makes sense. You know, spinny things are fun. Look at that. I can do that. Call upon fourth. There's a hidden penguin up there. I'm not gonna destroy the hidden penguin. I think it's having fun, chilling out, being underground. Who doesn't? Mind you, I cannot guarantee safety, you know, in case something happens. But, you know, underground, chill ground. Uh, that's the words I'm saying. It is the words I'm choosing to use to express myself. Alright, you know what? I changed my mind. I did it! I changed my mind! How about you, little robot? Uh, that's right. It's the Molten Mantle. Man, we're just going through. A lot of these levels are just kind of airy uh, Yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, and this is what the early game felt like, like before Turbo. Mm-hmm. All right. And there is a lot of targets here. Welcome to You Are Gonna Be Busy Country. The place where you might be busy, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, according to the name we gave, but uh, I mean, names or whatever, right? Got myself a bounce, and now I got myself an explode. That thing just died before me needing to get too close. Uh, trying to destroy this rotisserie chicken, and it's happening right now! That feeling when you're like you're kind of moving, but then whoa, 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 whoa! Like some weapons, kind of hold you on the ground and you're not moving. Others don't. And sometimes you just kind of switch around and you're not necessarily ready for it. But we got ourselves a big explosion. Magma vents. We gotta vent them out. Magma needs air. Uh huh. This is what it looked like before. I had the crystals and waterfalls and lava blocks. Mm-hmm. Oh, the game really was a graphic stop. What? Really? I thought I loved 
the hyper minimalistic pass of this game. Like, honestly, you could argue that the current look is a bit a lot busy. Like, even busier somehow. Explody guy. Yeah, I just kind of, I don't know what happened there, but it's happening, all right? I don't know what I'm doing. Here are the magma vents. It's the vent. Roll up the magma. Do I want to use wet? I, I can't use wet. It is strong. And I can jump right into an explosive. I mean, that is an option. You know? I, it is. I, I will not deny the reality that it can't... No, no, no. What you want to do is... Keep whipping your main hand, but you can still use the combos with the with the special spot. Like that's the way to go. That's the strat. All right, here we go, Strat Man, on the quest for strategy. Is it? Whoa! I'm trying to go diagonal here. I'm not trying to move. There are distinct differences. All right, so, so now we're here, and it's a frog. Is these guys that live there. Person just jumped. Uh, pretty incredible, if you ask me. Jumping in this day and age is pretty impressive. All right, buddy, there you go. And over there, there's a froggo. I've got shields, and you got blown up. Uh, and that's the way it'll go. It's the tar climb. Time to climb that tar. This is another really early custom level. That was pretty cool. It was cut for length reason. Leafy is. Uh, mm-hmm. Hmm, that's true. That's right. Well, I don't like Reflect, though, so we might have a problem. I should have taken a wave. I absolutely should have taken a wave. Just so I could, like, attack through walls. I've removed that as my ability that I can do. But, like, they're all hanging out here. Like, they're just kind of, like, being here. It's pretty something. Alright, I don't, I don't, I don't want that. There we go. Now we're talking. I got myself a rainbow sword. I can just jump up and go, hey, it's rainbow sword. Do you have your rainbow sword subscription? Well, here is a free sample to just kind of get you excited. I hope it works. It eliminates bunnies. I don't know if you've noticed. You don't want to eliminate bunnies? Well, once you get your hands on rainbow sword, boy, howdy, your opinion's just gonna change. Because you're going to be looking for excuses to use your rainbow sword. And bunnies are a good excuse for that, in my opinion. I don't know. Okay. There's a lot happening here. Like, I feel like I'm just kind of ignoring a lot of the smaller enemy that's kind of chilling. And normal sword, you know, it's fine. It's not exactly at the same caliber. So here we go. Rainbow Sword is back. You saw what the experience was with with, Rainbow, with Normal Sword. And then you compare with what's going on with Rainbow Sword. And now you're going to understand. Reactor Core. Factory, when sprays me well the first time around, this is the only major level that I could cut. Uh-huh. Oh, interesting. Main Reactor. Okay. All right. Play, play a worse version of the level you play. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I'm just being silly. I think that might be one. Ah, uh, you know what? I feel like uh, bounce might have been the choice here. Whoa. Yeah, I remember. Well, I remember the level that is very similar to this. All right, buddy. I'm just gonna kick you and you give me a heart. Wow, this beautiful. Well, a heart is beautiful. All right, you know what? No, yeah, gear is good here. That makes sense. Black gear get you through surfaces and harder you know you get rid of both get rid of all your teeth services oh that's that's a problem i have actually i don't suggest that animal is very fragile take care of that oh my health is very fragile you should take care of that too well i mean you you shouldn't take care of my health that's that's not for you to do but, you know, you know what I mean. You know what I'm saying. I just heard a pshwee. That very exciting. I'm just jumping to that later. I saw an electrical, like, just line. And I was like, you know what? I wish to get involved with that. I, I wish to just directly put my body in the middle of whatever's going on there. And that guy's going to get pushed. He was like, what? I'm out of here. I'm sideways now. And now I got a supernova. Just for you, that's why I blow up the world inside a reactor, and then it's done, and then we're gone. Here we go. Prison escape, we're gonna escape from prison. That's right. Mm-hmm. 
scene in here was really cool. Yeah, yeah, and then it led to a whole world, as you just said. That's funny. All right, check it out. Yeah, I think I remember this. All right, so there you go. Now you're here. Yeah, like the bottom guys, you know, they're in charge of holding things together because they're invincible. Top guys, they're the newbies, and you know, maybe they don't quite know what's involved with this job. A little bit. I don't know. I'm just shooting that man that's standing in the void. We do now. Okay, well, take on land on your thing. That's right. I'm the thing lander. All right. So I'm gonna. I got. Whoa. That is a fun little attack. All right. Well, now I'm stuck with this, which is a lot less fun. But I mean, could be useful. Like here, for example. Like you don't need to get involved. You just do that and play like, spapow. And it is indeed spapow. <laughs> Can't get more spapow than that. I don't want that. Okay. There we go. Perfect. That man. Yeah. He's he's gone. We don't talk about that man. That man... You know, you're not immune. Alright, I still got two more keys to open up. Let's find some keys! Are you guys keys? Can you lead to a key? What do you think about keys? What about you? Do you have a text box that says keys over your head? You need to tell me if that's okay. What is this? Okay. I, there's a thing somewhere I opened up without realizing it. Extra exit for extra clocks. That's right. Find clock. Go away. Temporal anomaly. Uh huh. Okay. All right. All right. Fair enough. Tossing remote your barriers is fun. That's right. That's right. Yeah, that's right. But when you can't you can't speak, that's what it looks like. There you go. So the idea is okay. I see. You got your little safety zone. See. Oh, see. This makes sense as a way to learn about your friend remote. Because, you're like, you're in a weird spot, and it protects you. And you see that remote, they go through barrier, but their stuff doesn't go through barrier. Their stuffs are jerks. And that's how we will take care of business. Friend. Alright? I don't know why that got weirdly aggressive. Just accept it. Watch out, we're in a barrier, and I can put my carrots out. Make it all big, green, and bright while all the gear's flying about. Check it out, they're just hanging there. Will I make something here explode? Only one was left, and then he jumped away, and there I go. Yeah, see, remote is good in very specific areas. Okay. Well, everyone always did pretty much a sat. <laughs> oh, well, the thought was there. Oh, I see. Yeah, like, that's just kind of the reality, though. Like,. You're gonna see enemies, you're gonna attack them, it's like... Okay, but that is pretty rad though, so it's this big old block zone. Welcome to the block town. Tornado! I love Tornado! It's not always great as a, as a weapon, period. Oh boy, okay, here we go. Alright, making things fly off a little bit. Yeah, see, I'm just putting down the propello. I'm just kind of following my path here. I'm gonna uh, see this penguin! Penguin is gone! Yeah, Spinny! This level looks like it would be quite a pain to, like, go through. Like, to try to get everyone. Because everyone's so split apart, and depending on how you destroy things, some might would end up getting really hard to get to. But... They've removed a long time ago the need to destroy everyone. Maybe that's okay. 